Hello everyone, and welcome to a new video in which I bring you nothing more and nothing less than a mini map for Minecraft Pocket Edition for version 1.18, and it's this one that you're seeing down below to the right. You don't need to have the paper hand activated, I mean the character up in the top left that you're seeing now because you don't need to have it activated. As you can see I can deactivate it and the map is still there. And basically you don't need to activate the cheats either. It's simply a texture that as you can see, works. I'm going to put myself now at the limit of a chunk and we're going to pass a block and here another and here another and so that you can see if I look over there no matter how much the perspective changes it's true that the map when I see myself face to face is altered but as you see I'm always in the same point. I'm going to go to one of the corners of this chunk so you can see it no matter how much I change I'll always be in the corner of the chunk. The only thing is I see it differently but don't worry. So the arrow basically takes the direction in which you're going I honestly don't know if it also captures other players which would be cool but Honestly, I have no clue. We're now moving on to the installation. Down in the description, you'll find this. It's basically the link to the creator's webpage named Chainsketch. And essentially, you're going to scroll down to find two models, type 1 and type 2. And they're going to show numerous things like the chunk indicator, chunk coordinates and so on. Basically, we're going to scroll down and select Chunk Visualizer and we're going to download it. We're heading to Mediafire and we're going to click on Downloads here. We'll click on it. The M key pack, if a pop-up window appears, we close it and then the import would begin. Okay, here it is, duplicate pack since I already have it. All right, what do we do now? We're going to Settings, we're heading to Global Resources, Active, and basically we have it here. We would put it through here, go to Miss Packs that we would have it over here, press and hit Activate. The configuration gives us quite a few configurations. They give us the chunk indicator plus chunk coordinates. What we've seen before, the coordinates of the chunks. Only one of these with the map, such a type of map. We're going to try this chunk indicator because I think it's what it is. We're going to pull back. Obviously the configuration you must choose is that you operate based on what the page says, but well, the one that comes by default is the one left by the map that I've shown you. Then load the resource pack and well, nothing. Once we enter, this is what we find. I'll most likely have to go to settings and turn on coordinates to really see the full potential of this. Let's see, show coordinates, is it activated? I don't think so. Okay, let's see coordinates on. And well, nothing, even though we activate the coordinates, there it would be, we have the coordinates activated and the minimap is still visible, so don't worry either. So nothing, this would be the texture pack. I hope you like it and that you use it. The truth is that it is very good to know when you are doing a chunk cut and when you are not in a very visual way. And well, I hope you liked it and see you in future videos. Bye.